went on Facebook Marketplace and I have something very special in this box. And it's one of the rarest take and pay, take one of the rarest take along items that nobody can find. This is fresh in the box. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Here it is. Yo, Renee's is so hard to find, bro. So this is Renee's, which is kind of a hard take and play game to find. And I'm so glad I finally have a Renee's to complete my narrow gauge collection of the main engines. This is just. Oh no, I wanted to keep the box. Oh my goodness. Yeah, it's alright. I'll just buy something else. Oh dude. A new unbox to take and play Renee's. He looks actually pretty fantastic. I love the way he looks. It's a good model. I'm glad I have this collector card right here with me to hit hard for you. The old take a long manual. Holy moly, I remember seeing this thing, bro. I think the, the take a long item I had was Henry. Uh, I have Dennis now. All this, bro, this is so cool. And then you got the play sets on the back. Oh, man. Yo. This was so fun to own at the time. Like, just having this in my hands right now. Like, bro, being a kid at the time when Take Along was still around and you collecting these, buddy boy, let me tell you. So, I'm going to scoot Scarlet away aside. I'm going to show you the other narrow gauge engines that I have and customized. So, we have Scarlowe, who I upgraded to look like his season 24 version of himself with the little gold pipes in the back. Of course, his windows are painted gold. Has the lamp in the front with the little railing right there, railings on the sides. Also, someone has like a little bit of black dot there to represent where the steam comes out of. And Scarlo is, I think, the only narrow gauge engine without a colored roof. So that's cool. Just Scarlo next to Reneus. It's actually pretty awesome. Next, we have Sir Handel, which I also got off the Facebook marketplace. And honestly, he looks really good. I customized him to look like um, his season 24 version as well. Gold paint on the back. Um... That little gold pipe right there. Railings again. Little thing that he has right there. I, I think Sir Handel's gotta be one of my third favorites on like Scarlowe. Now the next we have my third, third favorite, favorite, which is Peter Sam. Now Peter Sam is my first ever narrow gauge engine. Yeah, Peter Sam was my first ever narrow gauge engine that I ever owned. And I just thought I would make him special. Got a black running board in the show, lamp irons on the side, painted the things on the side on gold. Um, his back, I think because my favorite part of him, of Peter Sam is the back of him. Got the lamp and the gold stuff right there. All right, um... Next, we have Rusty, who I also got off of Facebook Marketplace. Uh, basically, four of these engines I'm going to show are from Facebook Marketplace. But Rusty's from Facebook Marketplace. I, I like Rusty. He looks pretty cool. Um, I think because he looks pretty cool, this is the... the I don't know. I just like Rusty. Something about Rusty makes me like it. Like... He has this door, and then he has, like, two windows. Like, it's pretty cool. 
Now, the last of the main narrow gauge engines that we have here, Duncan. Yeah, Duncan. I love Duncan. Duncan's got to be my first favorite narrow gauge engine. I feel like Duncan's everybody's favorite narrow gauge engine. One of his lamp irons uh, came off, so... Yeah, um... Anyway, you can see on the sides of Duncan, he has the wires right there. Those are from the Railway series. And you can see I added the gold line right there. I need to stop voice cracking. I hate it. But I added the gold little pipe right here that's connected to his dome. And then I added his whistle, which looks pretty cool. And he has the back and the front windows, which I just took the lamp iron off, bro. Doesn't matter, he don't need them. Anyway, yeah, so this is Duncan, my first favorite narrow gauge custom. Now it's time for the extras. So first we have um, Luke, who's another narrow gauge engine. Which, honestly, I like what Adventures did with Luke, except for when I get to the backside when I was a kid. But we're not going to talk about that. All right, the next one we have is Victor, going off from the CGI series. Uh, yeah, somebody messed up my take and played Victor, so I might have to live in one. And so I'm just stuck with this one for now. Uh, I really do not like this. Like, I don't, I don't see why they would make Victor so fat. Like, see, can't you see the wires, like, the little pipes that he has, like, through the, the, yeah, see, right there. You can see those pipes that are supposed to be gold, but they're not, because freaking Mattel decided to be lazy. One of the other narrow gauge engines going on from the classic series now, we have Duke, without a tender. Dang. From the Coldy Fell Railway from the Railway series. Coldy, of course. Coldy from the Railway series. Uh, picked this up around the time Mattel switched to CGI in 2013. And I just decided to pick this item up. Very clean condition, except for like the roof, and it has like some metal scratches on it. But yeah. The only portrayal, portrayal of Coldy that we have. So these are all of the narrow gauge engines that I own and more to come like Mighty Mac and Freddy and Millie and that's basically it. So just missing three narrow gauge engines now. Uh, just Millie, Phyllis, Freddy and Mighty Mac. I forgot to mention this, but Scarlo even has that little gold line around his funnel like he does on his take along model. Cause this is the, um, this is the 20, 2010 Scarlet Wing. All right, guys. So these are all the narrow gauge engines. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I'm so glad that you stuck around with me to show, to see this wonderful Reneus model that I now have in my hands. And hopefully more narrow gauge engines that come as um, we unbox more narrow gauge engines in the future and i'll see you guys in the next video peace if you want a shout out next video um link in the description to my discord server today's shout out goes to jack kennedy um all right and i'll see you guys later that's it okay bye